following more developing news out of Puyallup this morning as we track armed robberies across King and Pierce counties. Our Nikki Torres joining us now live from Puyallup. So Nikki, good morning. What's the latest there? Good morning. We have a lot to talk about. I just got off the phone with y'all at police department. They listed out all of the different reports that they have taken overnight. Basically started right around midnight, went all the way up until right around four in the morning. I just counted how many were on that list that they told me. There were about eight on that, and that was just from Puyallup police telling me that alone. We could hear about more later on throughout this morning. So let's talk about the two that we know that we know most about. One of them is right here in Puyallup. This is the Valley Market. You can see that the glass has been broken out from the front door. Nobody was in here when the time of the, the burglary was earlier this morning, but they did get away with some vape cartridges. I'm told that they got away with some cash as well as a few pairs of shoes in the back. Now, there was another one that happened in Edgewood. That was about one this morning. That was an armed robbery at the 7-Eleven on Meridian East on the 800 block. I'm told that the suspects were gone when deputies arrived, but essentially the clerk said that suspects came in wearing masks and they were armed with handguns. They demanded money from the register. They got it and then they left in a car. Let's go over the series of events in a timeline from what happened earlier this morning, starting right after midnight. Again, I counted about eight incidents that they told me about from the police department. The first one was a robbery. That one happened on the 7-Eleven in South Meridian. What happened was that a woman who was driving driving a car. She got into the 7-Eleven. She came out. And when she came out, a black male around 20 to 35 years old showed her a handgun. He demanded the car. And then he stole the car, drove down the street, and picked up at least one other person. Shortly after that, at right around 1 in the morning, they robbed a 7-Eleven in Edgewood, the one that I just mentioned. After that, at 1.15, there was a burglary right here at Valley Market. 1.20, just five minutes later, they tried to do a vehicle prowl at North Meridian Hometown Studios. What happened there, they broke the window of a car that was actually occupied. So the person that was in there was a man. They woke up. The people who were trying to steal that car, they pulled a handgun, and then that person actually drove off. Shortly after that, at 1.30 in the morning, the, they robbed a 7-Eleven clerk at gunpoint. That was on West Stewart in Puyallup. Once again, at 2 in the morning, they robbed another 7-Eleven, and this one was in Federal Way. About an hour after that, 3.20 in the morning, an AM, PM on South 320th and Military Road in Federal Way, they robbed that as well. The last one that we have here on record is about 3.30 in the morning, and this is a robbery that happened at a Chevron in Maple Valley. So the car that they are looking for right now it is that 2020 Honda Civic that's about blue, gray in color. Uh, police also told me that, uh, A, they have not recovered that vehicle, but they are also talking about a Hyundai that was stolen out of Auburn. It could be an SUV. They don't know if it's related to these, but they know that it is possibly tied to these cases. So that's the update that we have so far. Again, we could hear about more robberies later on throughout this morning. So we'll keep you updated here with all of the developments. Live in Puyallup, I'm Nikki Torres, Fox 13 News.